Well, guys, we've got some bad news. The Roblox games that ban your accounts, they're back. Literally got out of bed just to report on this. It's that big of a deal. So the RTC Twitter account, they just tweeted and they said, beware of recent Roblox games that may ban your account. They mislead users into unknowingly uploading assets, which are inappropriate. These assets are then reviewed by Roblox moderators, which then terminate your account in seconds. Streamers are being targeted, but anyone can be a victim. And then of course, here is a screenshot of what seems to be an innocent Roblox game. You click play on it and then boom, your account gets deleted. Now, if this story seems familiar to you, well, you didn't click on an old video. This is actually something that has happened numerous times in the past. You see, back in 2022, two years ago, good, good lord, we're getting old. There was an incident on Roblox known as the Crosswoods incident. Basically, what it was is a series of games. They were called Crosswoods. Here's a screenshot of what it looks like. And if you clicked play on this game, well, your Roblox account would get deleted. Now, you might be asking, well, how's that possible? Well, how can just playing a Roblox game get your whole account deleted? This has to be fake, right? Well, actually, no, because you see, Roblox is kind of dumb sometimes. Here's the actual footage of the event two years ago. Basically, what happened is you would join into the game. Your camera would shake a little bit, and then it would say that you got kicked from the experience. And then whenever you logged out of the experience, you clicked leave, it would say your account was deleted. And, well, I would show the ban message, but um, it, it's pretty bad. You see, whoever created this game actually hid an exploit in the game. And whenever a player joins the game, that exploit would take control of your Roblox account chat. Essentially meaning that the game could make your account, your character, your avatar, say whatever it wanted into the chat and so what it would do is the game would make your character your avatar your account say a bunch of really bad things just absolute disgusting things this would then of course get automatically reported to roblox moderation which would then automatically terminate your roblox account like like these were gruesome terrible things like downright almost illegal thing actually i'm pretty sure some of the things were illegal basically all you need to know is it was really bad all right it was really bad thing thousands of people ended up getting banned from this basically what would happen is the people who created these games, the hackers, exploiters, whatever you want to call them, they would contact small streamers on YouTube or Twitch or TikTok and be like, hey, here's some money. Play my new game. I just made it. The streamers would check it out and then, you know, of course, all of their audience would too, leading to thousands of people getting falsely terminated. And well, that issue was fixed. Roblox patched that problem, but now it seems it's back. So let's dig into it. Here's a tweet here that says there's a new game that gets your account deleted for child endangerment. The game is called the infinite curse here's a screenshot from malistar's stream Mal malistar's stream malistar here is a roblox twitch streamer i believe and as you can see from the screenshot her account was deleted permanently terminated for child endangerment let's let's watch the clip so it says up here that a viewer calls the streamer to play a game probably through a donation or something and then the streamer entered the game without having any idea that the game is malicious because i mean of course not why would joining a roblox game get your account banned that's stupid who would think about that who would think that's even a possibility. Anyway, someone donates a bunch of money, says, hey, play my game on stream. The streamer here joins the game. And then it says down here at the bottom, the game displays blurry buttons for her to click on. I'm guessing right here is one of the blurry buttons. She probably thinks it's just part of the game. But it says this button is actually the confirmation to create an inappropriate model on her account. But the screen is blacked out so she doesn't know about it. So whenever she clicks this button here, it's going to upload something really, really, really inappropriate on her Roblox account, hence why her account gets deleted. Again, probably something borderline illegal, if not illegal. It says down here, you can see that in a short moment, a model has been created. And it should pop up. There it is right there. You can find the model in your inventory. She's probably like, what in the world is this? Must be part Part of the game or something i wouldn't know what that is right i'm not really a roblox developer i i, I wouldn't know what that pop-up meant so the game's loading assets she clicks okay she's in the game playing through the game a little bit. And then at some point she gets this message here. Same account launched experience from a different device. She leaves the game and well, this is this is when the termination happens. And then you're gonna see here in a clip that she's logging back in. It says connection error, she can't connect. And then account deleted. Reason, child endangerment. And here's that package that she uploaded or was tricked into uploading from that Roblox game. And in terms of Roblox moderation, 
they have no idea that she got tricked. They think it was actually just her uploading something really bad on her account. So they just instantly delete her and that's it. She's probably not going to get her account back. Now, of course, I shouldn't have to tell you guys don't do what I'm about to do. I'm kind of stupid, but I'm going to look up the game on Roblox here and, you, you, you know, I'm, I'm stupid. But it does look like Roblox has taken the game down or it, maybe it's gotten deleted. And I can actually confirm that as of a few hours ago, the game has been taken down. So Roblox has deleted the game. Roblox is at least aware of the situation. But anytime a situation like this pops up, we always, we as in YouTubers, always get the question, is it safe to play Roblox? Should I play Roblox right now? I don't want my account to get deleted. And I mean, look, here's the thing. There are probably hundreds, if not thousands of new Roblox games created every day. 99.99999% of these games are going to be fine. If you're playing your Adopt Me's, your Brookhaven, your Blade Balls, whatever it is, Shouldn't have said that. You're, you're probably going to be fine. The only people that really have to worry about stuff like this are people like me, the Roblox streamers. And this is why it's such a big problem. And this is what sucks. On streams, I get donations all the time. People donate hundreds of dollars. And they're like, Creek Crap, can you play my new Roblox game? I just created this Roblox game. Can you play? It literally happened in my last stream. Someone donated $100. They're like, please, 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 please play this Roblox game. I spent dozens of hours, hundreds of hours on it. You're my favorite YouTuber. Please play this Roblox game. And I I can't. I, I, I can't. I, I, I'm scared to do that, right? Because how am I supposed to know if it is a fan that wants me to play the Roblox game or, or maybe it's not a fan. Maybe it's one of these hackers, right? And maybe when I join this Roblox game, my account's going to get deleted and every viewer that also joins that game is also going to get their account deleted. You know, by by having a situation like this on Roblox, it puts not only me in danger, Right, but it puts my audience in danger and it makes us YouTubers have to be really, really careful what Roblox games we play. And that sucks, right? That sucks because I'd love to check out a bunch of new Roblox games. I'd love to check out fans games and, and new Roblox games and small developers games, but like we can't because there's a chance that our accounts could get deleted because this has been a problem now. This is like the third or fourth time that a situation like this has popped up and it's it's mind blowing to me that situations like this even can pop up. You know what I mean? Like, like, how is this even possible? Like, like, why is it possible that a Roblox game is able to upload something bad, a, a, an image that's probably illegal on your account for you? Like that, that's just, that's weird. I don't understand it. I'm not a Roblox game developer. Maybe there's something missing there, but it just blows my mind that this has been an ongoing issue for two years now, two plus years now. And it's still happening occasionally. It's kind of crazy. Now, something funny that has came out of this, the Roblox streamer that got banned here, uh, Malie Mally Malastars, um, she's actually holding a funeral in Roblox tomorrow for her Roblox account since it got terminated. So I thought that was pretty funny. We can we can join her celebration and wish her a nice farewell for, you know, taking the bullet for all of us, you know, because if it wasn't her, it could have been someone else. It would have been someone else. So Malastar's hats off to you. It's also funny because according to this tweet, this is one of her only times playing Roblox. She normally doesn't even play Roblox. And the one time she plays Roblox, all of this happens. Roblox moderations. Security. It's kind of weird. Sometimes it works, sometimes it doesn't. Anyway, guys, if you ever ask me to play your Roblox game, maybe you're a new developer, a small developer or something, and I say no, this is probably why I'm saying no. All right. E either I'm just really grouchy that way that day and grumpy and, you know, being an old man and get off my lawn or this. So at least now you guys know you'll be safe. Don't worry about it. Go play Roblox. Have fun. But as always, don't join sketchy looking Roblox games because your account could get banned. All right. Stay safe out there.